today's video, I'm going to share with you a natural homemade remedies that can help you to get rid of spots and blemishes on the skin. Now, this remedy, I'm using just simple ingredients, ingredients you could find in your kitchen just hanging around. And I'm going to take you step by step, show you how to prepare this remedy. And I'm also going to show you how to use it on your skin for best result. So if you have a scar or if you suffer like from acne scars, spots, blemishes on your skin, on your face, and you're trying to clear the skin then maybe this video is for you so continue. now I'm gonna be using tomato and to use a tomato you just want to cut the tomato and blend and here I already have some blended tomato I'm also gonna be using some lemon in this recipe and lemon is great for getting rid of spots and blemishes from the skin lemon is gonna lighten and brighten that skin while giving your skin a dose of vitamin C now our next ingredient in this recipe is banana peel and banana peel is great for getting rid of spots and blemishes on the skin so whenever you peel your banana do not throw it out just leave the skin to use to get rid of spots now to use the banana peel I'm just gonna scrape it like I'm showing here just scrape the inner peel of the banana and that is the only part that we're gonna be using so just scrape the inner peel that's good right there go back to the other piece and this is a half of a medium banana peel that I'm scraping and this is done here we have our banana peel you can choose to blend this but I don't like to blend it's not a lot so I just like to just chop it in small pieces just as if you're mincing something so just dice it really really fine and once this is done this is ready to use so our banana peel is ready our next ingredient is aloe vera gel if you have fresh aloe vera go ahead and use that however today I'm gonna to be using the store-bought aloe vera gel and this is also great to get rid of spots and blemishes from the skin so let's put this together and this is about a tablespoon of blended tomato and we're gonna add our our banana peel to the tomato and we're just gonna give it a mix just blend it in nicely as I'm showing here just mix well next I'm gonna reach for my lemon juice and I'm gonna squeeze about a, a teaspoon of lemon juice in this recipe next my aloe vera gel and I'm using about a teaspoon of aloe vera gel and then we're just gonna blend this together just blend well and the wonderful thing about this is that it's not gonna turn dark because we're using the tomato and the lemon juice in this it's not gonna get dark at all now if you have oily skin acne prone skin this is a wonderful remedy for you because it's gonna help to clear that acne up and it's gonna get rid of the acne scars from your skin now if you have large pores on the skin this is also a wonderful remedy it's gonna to have to clean that pores out and eventually your pores will shrink and your skin will just look amazing so this is ready and I'm gonna show you on the other side how to use this wonderful mask for best result. Now before you apply this to the skin you want to start with clean skin so you're gonna wash your face the way you normally do just cleanse your face of all the grease and dirt from the skin and then you're gonna apply this is a very light mask so I like to use a brush to apply it to my skin so I'm just gonna take the brush and apply it to the skin in upward strokes if you want to make this mask a little more effective you can choose to place it in your refrigerator just before you use it okay 
Now once you finish applying it to the skin, just sit with it for about 30 minutes. If you have more time, sit with it a little longer. Now after that, you're gonna rinse this off, best rinse off in the shower, and you're gonna pat dry and apply your favorite facial moisturizer or your favorite facial toner. Now this facial mask is best to use at least two to three times per week for best results. You can make enough of this and store it in your refrigerator for about seven days. So there you have it. Thank you all for watching. If you like the video, just leave a little thumbs up and a comment. Those are always welcome. And if this was your first time watching, you wanna see more of these videos, just look below. You're gonna see the word subscribe. Click on it and you will be subscribed. Also, if you look below the video, you're gonna see my face. If you click on my face, it will take you to my channel page. On my channel page, you will find a wide variety of videos. Just search for whatever topic you are interested in. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.